Okay, a nice box from India. Let's have a look. Nicely packed. Very solid feeling. Heat sink on the back. Wow, look at that display. Excellent construction. What have we got? Number 33. How about that? Alright, well, let's go and plug it in. Okay, well we're out in the shack and uh, time to power this thing up. So, it fits. Plug in an antenna and switch it on for the first time. I can see lights. Oh, look at that. Oh. There's a few instructions that come with it. Uh, this is the developer's edition, version 1.0. It's making a few strange noises. Okay, so I think to launch the software... Here we go. Oop! Wow, look at that. So, let's, uh, antenna's plugged in. Let's try uh, 40 meters. Probably about three meters, three meters long, sort of thing. And I've got a little uh, oil on the end of it. I drive them in the ground with uh, dead things, so they're, uh, they're driven into the ground at either end of it. Yeah, yeah, I do, I, I do the same thing with one of my vertical set I'll play with. VK3 Tango Papa Mike. Tango Papa Mike, yeah, very distorted. Uh, is that correct? Tango Papa Mike, over. Uh, that's correct. Uh, it's a new radio, experimental radio, so apologies for that, but uh, I'll uh, go and have a look at the RF. Thank you for the contact. <laughs> Ooh, 
lost audio. What's happened? Huh. Can't hear him. Well, he heard me, but it's distorted, and uh, now I've lost audio altogether. I wonder why. Anyway, off to a good start. Yeah, okay. Okay, well, after. Um, Rebooting the um, the Pi, the audio did come back, so I'm not sure what's going on there. Anyway, I'm going to do some work on um, maybe put some uh, ferrites on the mic and uh, see if that's the problem there. But yeah, the radio works quite well. He could hear me, although I could see there was RF feedback in the audio. Anyway, let's hit uh, stop. Good stuff. <laughs>